It's your boy, Mr. Halai, here with another video. And you guys won't believe where I am. I am by the Manahan Stadium in Surakarta, which means we'll be going to watch the soccer game Morocco versus Senegal. It's going to be starting in about an hour and a half. So, I took a 10 hour. 10 hour bus 10 hour bus okay so follow i've been up since 5 in the morning and right now it's 5 30 a guy by the stadium so you guys gotta make sure to smash that like button and subscribe to the channel because we're gonna go inside and support the moroccan team we're gonna make sure there's a red Vlad and Senegal gets kicked out of the quarterfinals. So let's uh, hit in. These kids must uh, here, here supporting. They're gonna say all of us. Come on, guys! Now we can be on the video. Hello. Hello. Hi. You from? Uh, Afghanistan. My name is Mr. Halal. <laughs> you guys are supporting the game? Morocco? Yes. Go Morocco! Go! Yeah. <laughs> Inshallah, I'll see you guys inside. Yeah. Where are you from? I'm from uh, Afghanistan. Afghanistan. Yes, we're going to be supporting Morocco today. Go Morocco! Go Morocco! See you guys inside. Inshallah, <laughs> people are amazing here, you know. Every corner you look, everybody's super nice. Whether it's kids, it's adults, everybody's trying to help you. You know, especially if they see that you're not from around. Because um, I, I stand out here a little bit in comparison to when I went to Morocco. So people are really, really helpful. I'm just here by the entrance. I just got to go in now. I don't want to get in trouble with the police. So let me turn this off. Okay, and in there. Assalamualaikum. Tim Akashi. Hey, made it. Check this out. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm going to get searched. I had a big bag as soon as I came earlier. They told me you got to go put your bag away. So there was actually a checkpoint on the other side. Or not checkpoint. There's actually, they were like police. And they're, um, they're taking the, the bags. And uh, later on, you can go and uh, pick it up. So I go. I made it through the checkpoint, a bit of stuff. I had a nail clipper with me. It didn't even have any knife or anything, it was just a nail clipper. It says prohibited. So, I'm like, you know what, I'm, I'm not causing any problem, guys. Just take whatever. Take whatever you guys want to take, just let me into the stadium. What time is it? Right now it's 6 02. 7 o'clock, inshallah, is the Moroccan game start. So I think uh, Uzbekistan was playing another team. That game just finished. So here, let me just go to the corner and show you guys what uh, they have here. And then here they have started. I'm not sure what this is. Kick it. Some promotion that over there is Sprite and Hyundai. And then, yeah, a bunch of other. There's the official fan shop. Maybe let's go there, see what they have. 
Jadi harus registrasi dulu. Boleh. You seven aja. King World Cup. Silakan. Oh, they actually have a. I think they're playing Xbox or PlayStation. Oh, Brazil is playing in in Jakarta. Tiga satu. Oh, we're not interested in in Brazil. Lagi, lagi. Here is the official. Oh, they have fish. What the heck? You wouldn't expect to see this. This fish. Beta fish. Or maybe because Indonesia is probably famous for their beta fish. So they have it. They kind of made a wall out of beta fish. It's pretty cool. I'm just looking at the injury time offered discount, 50%. I'm gonna I'm gonna ask them if they have stuff for Morocco. Yeah, lagi ramai banget. Memang karena sudah selesai nih match yang pertama. Kita masih menunggu nanti ada match yang kedua. It's one leg soccer. Oh wow, he's using a good trick to block. Oh nice. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. That's pretty intense game there. Oh, this is a much on them just says U17 World Cup Indonesia 2023 I thought they're actually gonna have uh, like team jerseys or something but they have the Hyundai Ionic here I I thought I saw one a couple of days ago was driving but I didn't know that uh, actually they have uh, electric cars in Indonesia so they do have it check it out guys it's the Ionic they already have it plugged in as well I don't know if this is the real charging cable though Because usually the cable is much thicker. Like that. Oh my god, there's like bugs flying around. Oh, look at that. 2022 World Car Award. Car of the Year. Interesting. If you guys want more information, scan the QR code. Cars. I hope that Indonesia gets more electric cars because there's a lot of smog because of all the the cars, scooters, and stuff that are on the road. Uh, in the mornings, weather's pretty good, but then at nighttime, or like basically once work and stuff starts, it starts getting uh, smoggy because there's a lot of. I think there's like millions and millions of motorcycles. I had heard that uh, Subhanallah Marrakesh had a lot of motorcycles and, and I saw that when I went there and uh, thought that maybe they had the most amount of motorcycles. Uh, until I came to Indonesia, especially Jakarta, that's when I uh, realized that Indonesia has more motorcycles than uh, Marrakesh. Like they say, the calm before the storm. Everybody's uh, re-energizing, taking a break before the uh, 
the game masters. Okay, okay, guys. I'm gonna conserve my camera's battery, and in a little bit we'll take you guys inside. Okay, so let's go inside. This we got more uh, Molly fans. They just getting ready to head, and now I'm heading in too. So let's go. I can see the pitch. What is this? Oh, power. There's Coke here selling drinks. Coke and uh, FIFA, they go hand in hand. There's a lot of trucks. There's like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, six uh, power trucks and one medic. I hope I didn't miss past gate too. Ah! <laughs> it's super fun. As soon as I got by the gate earlier, I didn't even have the camera out or anything. It was just all of them were giving me high five. It's super cute. Yeah, and like I said, everybody's super super nice here. Uh, alhamdulillah, I haven't had any issues. And for that reason, I don't want to give them a hard time too, you know. If they say, this thing's not allowed, I'm like, okay, no problem. Because earlier, when I came, I asked them, I'm like, can I fly a drone? They said, yeah, that's fine. If you go on top of the stadium, at least that's what I got from it. Um, it's okay. Let me see where I am. Row P. Row P section. Row P sector number three, seat 101. Let me ask them. Hey, hold on, guys. I'm going to tell you that story, but hold on. Sorry. Uh, wait. Here? Okay. Tima Kathy. Okay. So, yeah. He said you can fly your drone. Just make sure it's on top of the stadium and. Like I said, that's what I got from it. So I went, I got my drone, got it ready. Uh, as I was about to fly it, they came and said, if you're gonna fly it, your freak, the drone frequency might interfere with uh, their uh, broadcasting. So I said, okay, no problem. You guys say no, I'll put it away. So yeah, I didn't fly. And then I uh, just let it be, it's okay. It's not a big issue. What's crazy is that they don't have any food stands, like the stadium's there. Usually the stadium's there, like all of these would be food stands, as well as like here, they would be selling food. But here, the only thing that I saw was just the Coke. Yes, Number 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 Nice they uh, warmed up my chair for me. It's a little bit hard to see because the camera doesn't really pick up the uh, screen. Woo. It's too hot here, guys. Too hot. So let's uh, wait for the game to uh, start. And then 
we'll get recording. Yes. 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 So close. They added seven minutes on the clock, and it's one for Mali, zero for Morocco. I can't watch anymore, man. It's BS. I think the referee is uh, on the Mali side. Seems like it. Plus, uh, looks like Mali brought like a like a voodoo priest or something. They go wild. I'm done. I don't want to sit there anymore, man. It's stressing me out. It's like. Two minutes left, and they're down one goal. And uh, yeah, they're not playing that well today. Morocco's from from the time that like the game started, I could tell the goalie was a little bit off. Like he was stressing. And uh, when you stress, you can't think straight. So yeah, that's it happens. That's uh, that's what happened with games, right? It could go any way. Uh, well done to the Mali team for their hard work. They took it and I think Morocco is out. Morocco is now out and then I guess it's going to be Mali versus Uzbekistan I'm guessing because uh, they were saying that Senegal is out. So, Palace. I gotta start heading out, go get, go to the shop again, and then I gotta go across the street, get my bag, I had to leave with the police, and then from there I gotta find a way to get to, to get to a, the train station, inshallah, because uh, I have a train to take at 11, and it's gonna get to Jakarta, by 7.30 or 7 a.m. Uh, it's just crazy, man. It's like another eight hours. Like, I I took an eight hour... It's all good. I took a, I was going to say I took an eight hour 
bus, another eight hour train, and the Moroccan team let me down, man. All good. I think they did pretty well to make it to the quarterfinal uh, play at this uh, stage in uh, in the world. I think it's it's pretty pretty awesome. So well done, boys. Uh, things like this happen, so maybe next time you guys can make it and take the cup. Oh, sorry. <laughs> so, these guys that have uh, on their back it says Grab or Gojek. They do food delivery, but they also do like human delivery. So, see, he's delivering me to the train station. So, my train's gonna come at 11 o'clock. It's my neighbor. Our neighbors driving on the side lane. Hey, they, it's crazy driving here. Like, people are cutting each other off. But it's still, a, it's a controlled chaos. It's not fully chaotic. Thanks to the brother. Alhamdulillah made it here. It's the train station. I gotta find out where do I check in? Where do I go? This is a train station. Kurwasari. The side is closed. <laughs> gotta go to the other side. But I think before we do that, let's go get some drink. And that way I can show you guys the market as well. This one. So they, they have uh, markets that are called Indu Mart and then also Alpha Express or Alpha Mart, I think. So I can get your coffees, teas. It's the noodles, ice cream, ah, lots of different drinks. Your Coke, Sprites, and water, and then as well as like energy drinks, coffee drinks, tea drinks, water. I need to get some water. Lots of water. Here's Holland. There's the water. They don't drink from tap, so everybody drinks water. And even in restaurants, they have like big. Filters of uh, like filtered water that they that they they use. I'm tired. I'm running out of breath. I gotta get something to drink because I need to get myself energized. What am I gonna have? This is okay. Okay, got a water. Okay, let's grab these and head out. Assalamu alaikum, hello family. Sorry I didn't get a chance yesterday to uh, update you guys and uh, let you guys know how it went on the train. I was super tired. I got the train. The train was late at 11.30 and uh, alhamdulillah made it to the hotel i think around eight then i had to go get another train to come up to another city so we're gonna wrap up that vlog for you guys here since i didn't get a chance um to and then uh, i'll start another one another video that you guys can go check out for what's going to be happening today so i hope you guys like that video and if you did then please don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe to the channel and also share with your friends and, and family and don't forget to follow me on instagram as well as on facebook uh, so we can stay connected 
Uh, so yeah, guys, without uh, further ado, thank you very much for your love and support. I hope you guys have yourself a wonderful day. Take care of yourself and your family. Show us to you guys in the next video. Take care and we'll see them.